Hey everybody, I am back with uh, Hobby Lobby slash Michael's Hall. Um, nothing too big. I uh, wanted to head out to Hobby Lobby. They're putting out tons of new goodies as far as um, crafting, paper crafting, scrapbooking. Of course, most of my sections were pretty emptied. But I did get a few things I was looking for. I was really looking for flowers, paper flowers. I don't have too much in my stash, so I did grab some of those. Um, I have a small Michaels haul. I'll just uh, combine with this Hobby Lobby. They didn't have too many sales as far as um, Hobby Lobby. They had 50% uh, off uh, all the um, open card stock, you know, uh, paper kits, paper pads. I think the ribbon was 50% off. They didn't have too much going on. I did use my 40% and I did do uh, two different transactions just to use a 40% off because I think most of the stuff that I got was not on sale. Um, the uh, die section was like, like I said, it was pretty emptied. All right, so I had um, this on my list. It's one of the new rosette dies from Sizzix, and you get two dies. I think it makes three different um, size rosettes, which I'm a little confused. So you get the large die, and then you get the second um, smaller die, but there is an opening in the large die, which is kind of confusing me. So I'm going to have the, um, get on, uh, you know, a video and see what that's all about, but I did want to get my hands on these. I love the little designs, um, and this would make, you know, really nice for parties or whatever you wanted to use them for, but I can't wait to play with those. And the next one is the Sizzix. Um, it's not a coffee cup die, it's just the sleeve. So you get those dies. Seen a few ladies decorate these on Instagram, and they were so cute. And you can, it fits the size of a traveling cut too. Cup, excuse me. Um, I'm not a crocheter, I'm really not great at um, sewing, stitching, uh, but even if you used a material, um, for this would be really cute. I'm pretty much, we'll probably use just paper and um, just decorate them up for gifts. And I, I'm not a coffee drinker, I drink tea. And I do have quite a few traveler cups. I would probably decorate one. Um, I don't know, put it on there. We'll see. Uh, this is another newer one um, at Hobby Lobby. I thought this one was kind of cute. It says, hello, it is connected to the circle. So I got that one. And then I just got some of the smaller word um, dies. Some, well, most of them I didn't have um, in my stash. I got that. And the next one, they have quite a few of the, like, foodie sweets um, dies. I just got some from Michael's that are very similar. I don't think it had the donut or the pretzel. These ones, I will have to kind of fussy cut, like, make a backing for them. But um, I'll do a, a project share when I do put some of those together. So those are the dies. And then I got one stamp set. And that was pretty emptied as well. I think this is my very first llama stamp um, set that I have. I'm not really into llamas, but um, a lot of friends are. So maybe if I make them something, I can use some of these little llamas. I did grab that. Paper flowers. I just grabbed some of the Paper Studio. This is like a, I guess a till. They're smaller. They do have pearls. And then I grabbed the pink. And these, I don't think any of those are are new. I know these are fine, but I so needed, you know, some flowers, paper flowers this size. So I just got the roses. So I got the purple and the pink. And then I, these I have not seen before, and I thought they were really cute. It's browns, micro uh, flowers, kind of like new, different shades of nudes. It does have some glitter on some of them. I thought those were really pretty and different, so I grabbed one of those. They're putting out tons of new charms. They have several different packs. I just got this one, this one, and then I got this one. The swans I thought was really pretty. To, and I have yet to make charms, and I have everything to make them. So I'm gonna have to start putting out, you know, bringing out some of my goodies and start making some charms. Um, and then they had a few different button sets. I have this one, just a cute little girly girl button set to add to projects. They put out some new bling, and these are just the little gemstone 
bling stickers. So you get the unicorn, which is glittered. I thought that was pretty. And then the donut. And they have a few other ones as well. And then this one. I just got those. Like I said, you know, nothing was really on sale. And then they had these. Let me grab. So you guys can see. And these are really cute little unicorns too. The unicorns with the stars. And then they had the swans, which I will most likely be getting one more of these little uh, swans. The bling came out this one, so I'll just glue that on there. But they look so delicate and so pretty. So I grabbed that one. And then, of course, I grabbed the llamas. And this one. Now, I probably would have grabbed another one of this one, but they only had one left. The little lipsticks and lips. thought those were really cute. All right. Um, washi. Uh, AC Moore has the paper house washi and this one was always sold out. I was, they had a few different sets in Hobby Lobby. Um, and this is Wonder Woman, kind of like a comic style. I thought was, you know, cute and different. I don't have her in my little washi collection. And then you get the little skinny. What the I would read it to you, but I can't even see it, honestly. So that one, and then this one is really pretty kind of reminds me of the sky and just has gold foil little um stars just believe and imagine and all that other good shit i'm pretty and then i got the lips with the lipsticks and the lipsticks has gold foil and i think like a little heart which is really cute and then i got this one i got the sunglasses then the lashes and i love the little eye shadows and um different colors in this one I thought that was really pretty. Those lashes are just an every damn thing. Ribbon, like I said, was 50% off. They put a ton of new designs in the smaller uh, ribbons. And these, I think, are only 99 cents with the 50% off, like 50. Um, so we got the little coffee cups. They actually got stickers that uh, look just like these. I hope it's focusing in. And then I got the floral with the black and white stripes. I thought that was really pretty. And then, of course, there's those lashes. And the mermaid. This has gold foil, mermaid tail, purple, and teal. Isn't that pretty? And then the unicorns, just different color. Unicorns. Why do my hands just feels like they're, like, I don't know. They look dark for some reason. All right. And then the girl ribbon. She's on everything at Hobby Lobby, which is really cute. I'm sure you guys probably already have it, but I have the larger, much larger ribbon of the little girls. And I honestly don't know what to use. it. It's super cute, but it's like really wide. And that's what I don't like about it. And I think I have like two of them. Um, I guess great for packaging, but I uh, rather use a smaller ribbon. But those are the ribbons and they had ton more um, different designs. I bought some buttons and flap backs. These I thought were super cute, the little cute kawaii, just sweets. I got two of these, and I will, mo if I don't use it as a button, what I do, and they cut off really easy, I'll just kind of snip the back part and use it as a flat back. So I got two of those. I got one of this one. Just, isn't that cute? A little I love that little um, dragon, and then the little unicorn fairy. Love the little faces. And then I got these are flat backs, little swans and glittered crowns. And then the little flowers, flower pots. And of course the unicorns and the rainbows. And then I got this one. I don't know if any is missing out of this one. I didn't even know that it was um like it's just kind of ripped. But I got two of the like the little fairy house uh doors, and then you get two little mushroom buttons and it doesn't say how many buttons come in here so i'm not sure if any are missing or not but i thought those were really cute so i got that washi and the, uh, they have several large tubes and smaller tubes of washi newer and of course i got the girly girl larger tube these were not on sale i did use 
a 40% on this and actually one of the dies I did two different um, transactions. This does have some gold foil. Whoops. Just, a, you know, girly girl set. Love this set. There's actually one other one that I really want, but I'm going to wait until they go on sale. And then I got one of the smaller tubes. This glasses, diamonds, lashes, kisses, mascara. So I got those. Um, and then I got a few sticker sets and a few uh, open card stock. Um, I got these little lashes with the glittered mascara. And these... I will probably have to get one more of these little mermaids. They're so pretty. The glitter and then the little blings. And I love the colors and these little. I hope you guys can see them. Aren't those pretty? Let's get this. Because I just love these little mermaid stickers. And then I got these swans, which I thought was really pretty. And they look so delicate. Just glittered swans. And then the little dog. With the glasses, a little bling. I think a little thing fell off there. I'm sure it's sticking somewhere around, hopefully. I thought those were different. And then this one is a repurchase. Um, I've been using these on my embellishments like crazy. They're just kind of like felt and foam um, swans, but I just, I love these. I think they're so cute. All right, so... I think that is it as far as just some glittered open card stock that I got some a few sheets. I'll share those in a minute. I'll get these out of the way. I went small Michaels haul. I went to Michaels to get um mat board. And I don't know if this is the right stuff. I'm hoping it is. The lady that helped me out said it was the right stuff. I'm just trying to make some room. Um so I only grabbed one they didn't sell it in like packs, and this is a huge, it's a large I'm hoping that it's like really thick. It says art board. Hopefully it's the same thing as mat board. I think this was $4.99. I had a 50% off um, used on one of the items, but I needed some of that for some of my Sizzix uh, dyes. So hopefully that's the right stuff. And then, like I said, I was on a little flower shopping spree today. So I got the yellow and then the blue. And I got two of these these are sequent um flowers just made of sequence and i thought those were so pretty aren't those pretty so i got two of um that and you guys these aren't cheap at all and from the backyard table which as of right now is my all-time favorite collection um at michael's so i just got some of the pink paper flowers and I think inside it just in the middle it just has like beads or just like little round pearls and then I got these I thought these were really pretty just paper flowers I also bought some of the two dollar like large puffy um stickers I just got uh the ice cream the cupcake the watermelon and then the floral. I love this little bird only because it has flowers on it. But I um, grabbed those. I also grabbed paint, folk art. Um, and I think you can get this a little bit cheaper at Walmart. Um, but I have not seen this color. And I think this color is so pretty. And it's Vintage Tea Rose. I'm not sure if it's coming through. But this um, is very pretty. So I grabbed one of those. And then I... Don't own any of these, and I have never played with it. And these are just the glitter paint writers. So I just got the, um, so I'm not sure how well these work, but I got one. I'll give it a little try. A few weeks ago, I'm sure you all probably already seen this collection. Um, I think it's a cute collection. I just don't really care for the papers and stickers, and I don't know. And this is um, actually scented washi. And they smell as they are, which I thought was, you know, kind of cool. But I, like I said, I bought that a few weeks ago. I, I don't think I hauled it. From the same collection, I got these die cuts. And those are, they're, you know, a big pack of die cuts. These were 50% off to use in summer projects. I also got some, oh, I got the bling too. Little bling um, stickers. I love this collection too. Um, Seeds of Faith. These are just vellum um, die cuts. I grabbed these. 
in these ones. They're so pretty. And then I grabbed two of the little um, stickers, clear stickers, which I love. Aren't those pretty? They have a lot of, um, it's like a little piece of washi. Do you guys see that? Holding like a little piece of paper. That is so cute. And there is a little teacup, guys. It does have a tea bag. Doesn't say anything about coffee. So I was happy to see a little teacup with a tea bag. So I got those from Michael's. What else? I got the, I was waiting. And they're um, hot by paper. It's 70% um, off right now. And I, and I bought two of these, and I had already cut into one of them. It's the English Rose Garden. And, of course, I didn't take the little sides off of this one. I'm going to make a tea-themed project with this paper. It's perfect for that. It's kind of a, it's going to be a vintage tea thing something. I'm only doing this just in case if you get, you know, so maybe someone didn't see this um paper pad so pretty i love the foil on it let's see if i can do it this way if i don't knock every damn thing over i'm gonna lift you guys up so this is just florals gold writing really pretty lots of florals I get a lot of cutouts in these or in this paper pad um too Flowers, butterfly, look at this one, little um, cherry blossom, birds, butterflies. Here's some more peace, hope, faith, love. There's some more little cutouts. I love this, look at this one, isn't that pretty? With the gold foil, I'm writing on it. It just reminds me of like my grandma's kitchen, this wallpaper. Yeah, so I got two of those with the 70% off. Um, I thought that was really pretty. And then I just got some glittered sheets. Nothing, you know, fancy, it's just basically glittered. Let me take her little folder out here. I gotta report my daughter's report card today. She is doing amazing in school. She's doing really, really good. Um, so I'm really happy about that. This is just like a, um, a really soft textured pink cardstock. This, um, they only had two of this one left and it's a really soft, maybe lilac purple, a glittered purple, um, sheets. And then I got a yellow and then I got these ones from Hobby Lobby. It's like a metallic gold. I got two of those, 50% off. And then I got a black. These are all non-shedding glittered um, paper. And a mint green. And then I got a gold, kind of with these little wedges, if that's what you want to call them. And then I just got a green shimmer. It does have a little texture in it. Um, for, you know, trees, grass. I also bought these little turtle dies. Um, I can use that with. And I think that is it as far as um, Michael's. I also stopped at Walmart. Well, I go to Walmart all the time here and there. And I picked up a few small things I figured I'd share. And this was, I think, last week, maybe two weeks ago. Um, now, you guys know I'm not a good... I can sew, but I'm not great at sewing. But I like the look of... Um, you know, sewing and uh, paper crafting. So I got some thread. I don't, I don't have any of this. So I got the gold, and then just a plain old white, a lilac purple, and this is like a transparent um, thread. What else did I get over here? I bought some needles too. I hope I took them out. These are little um, buttons, just little bow buttons. I'm gonna focus in. And those cute. Those black and eclair. And then I just got some rose, gold rose um, buttons. I bought two packs of these little bows. I'm loving the little polka dot, um, the black and white polka dot um, bows lately. I made some with um, some dyes. Remember, I was looking for flowers and I bought a pack of these from 
Walmart and I do not like these are not good for paper crafting they don't sit flat it has like a little point to them so yeah these definitely didn't work for what I wanted you know to do with it what else did I get I got this little tassel for something I'm doing just a black tassel with some bling they finally put out some cute little sticky notes at my uh, store I think these ones been out for a while though um, I actually bought two packs of these. I think these were $1.87, 84 something like that. And you get three. So you get, isn't that mermaid so pretty? And you can even use these as embellishments. So you can add maybe some glitter or use it like a glitter pen just to add to her or some sticko. I would definitely use her as an embellishment. And then you get the, um, yeah, I guess you get enough, but. And then you get the unicorn. Again, I would could add some little, um, just doll it up a little bit, and then you get the rainbow. And they also have a coffee cup. Um, it's more like a, yeah, coffee cup. But I already have that. I bought that, I think, like last year. But I got the little owls. I thought those were cute. I did. I grabbed two packs of these ones. And I think that is it. Um, I need to jump on here and... Um, redo i did a project share video and it failed to upload of course after i deleted it i made this i bought these little plaques and i think i shared these on one of my hauls these are the needles i got from walmart hopefully they do the job um i bought these plaques from dollar general for a dollar and i bought two of them um the other one i kind of messed up on i painted it and it just looked all kind of crazy so i wanted to do like a little unicorn theme something for Gigi's room and the stickers from where did I get these from Joanne's I got this off of one of those the newer sticker sets and I thought it worked perfect um, I'm actually gonna put a little hook on the bottom of this and so hang it in her room she could put her like her little robe on there um, but all I did with this was spray some of my um, glitter glitter dust the iridescent love this stuff i just sprayed the whole thing with the glitter dust and this is my unicorn dye from taylor expressions and just kind of cut it out in all kinds of glittered paper added the little sticker and i thought that was cute she loved it so i'm gonna hang that in her room i have a few more with a few more um ideals that i'll do and once i get those put together i'll um jump online and share those with you but she was happy when she seen that um what else cardstock i already showed you the cardstock everything else i'm done with this haul um make sure you guys come back because i have um two more things that i have uh that will be uploading tonight so anyways what am i 20 almost 25 minutes into this i'm just looking around because i'm always leaving something this is the little unicorn rosette that I made I hate when it does that it's from the glue I actually use hot glue to do that and I shouldn't because it always leaves like a little crinkle in it but using that dye again I made a little um actually it's not little it's kind of big a little unicorn rosette I made Gigi something like this um you know what I'll jump on and do a project here let me let you guys go because I'm just rambling on and I want to thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching. I appreciate all you guys. Um, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe and um, I will chat with you guys soon. Take care, guys. Bye.